Hello everyone, welcome to Infigyan. In this very exciting video of factorial equations, today in this video we will be solving one simple factorial equation which is 1 over x plus 7 factorial plus 1 over x plus 8 factorial equal to 256 over x plus 9 factorial. While solving this problem, we will use factorial, factorial notation, factorial properties, recursive formula and quadratic equation also. We will conclude our result. So let's get started by writing domain of the given equation. If you will see your denominator is x plus 7, x plus 8, x plus 9 at x equal to minus 7, at x equal to minus 8, at x equal to minus 9. Denominator is defined because that will make denominator 0 factorial which is 1. So we can write its domain would be x greater than or equal to also minus 7 where x belongs to any integer. Okay, we can write x must be greater than negative 7 and where x belongs to integer. Now let me begin this video by writing recursive formula which we will use ultimately. So what is recursive formula? It is n factorial is equal to n times n minus 1 factor. This formula is called recursive formula. We will use this. Let's multiply the given equation by x plus 9 factorial. Okay, right hand side also. So I will write here x plus 9 factorial. Once I will multiply, then x plus 9 factorial, x plus 9 factorial will get cancelled out. So what will be left in the left hand side? It would be x plus 9 factorial. If I will expand this bracket, I can write x plus 7 factorial plus x plus 9 factorial over x plus 8 factorial equal to 256. Now let's write, let's use recursive formula x plus 9 factorial I will write x plus 9 times x plus 8 times x plus 7 factorial over x plus 7 factorial plus again I will write x plus 9 factorial as x plus 9 x plus 8 factorial over x plus 8 factorial simple equal to 256 now easily you can cancel these two terms here also x plus 7 will get cancelled out so what is left x plus 9 times x plus 8 plus x plus 9 equal to 256 now let us expand this, take the product. So that will give us x square plus 8x plus 9x, 17x plus 72 plus x plus 9 equal to 256. So I can write x square plus 17 plus 1, 18x plus 72 plus 9 81 equal to 256. Let's take all the terms towards left. So it will become x square plus 18x plus 81 minus 256. So that would be 175 equal to 0. So now we have one quadratic equation which we will solve for x value. So how we can write a equal to 1, b equal to 18, 
c equal to negative 175 okay x is equal to minus b let me write under the root b square minus 4ac over 2a minus b so negative 18 plus minus square root b square so 18 square minus 4 a is 1 c is negative 175 over 2a so 2 times 1 so negative 18 plus minus the square root 18 square is 324 minus 4 times 175 so 800 minus 100 so it would be plus 700 over 2 minus 18 plus minus square root 1024 over 2 so if you will check this is 32 square so let me write in next step minus 18 plus minus 32 over 2 plus minus 32 over 2 okay now let's consider plus and minus both sign so if i will consider plus sign then it will become minus 18 plus 32 over 2 and if i will consider minus sign in between then it would be minus 18 minus 32 over 2 so this value will be 32 minus 18 so 14 over 2 7 minus 50 over 2 minus 25 now you can easily see if i will put x equal to let me write here x equal to 7 and let me write here x is equal to negative 25 if i will put this x equal to negative 25 in the given equation see what will happen equation will become minus 25 plus 7 minus 18 factorial plus 1 over minus 17 factorial which is not defined 256 over minus 16 factorial so negative of factorial is not defined so we will reject negative value okay this we will reject so only x equal to 7 is accepted value and which is correct answer now if you want to verify x equal to 7 is our answer if you want to verify then you can put over there see i substituted also i checked that value because 14 factorial will come in the first den denominator here here you will get x equal to 7 if you will put 15 factorial and 16 factorial right hand side that numbers are very very big if you want to see only I can give you only glimpse 8 7 1 7 8 2 9 1 2 0 0 see 15 factorial <laughs> factorial is 1 3 0 7 6 7 4 3 6 8 0 0 0 and see the value of 16 factorial 2 0 9 2 2 7 8 9 8 eight eight one two three zeros if you want to check you can put over there it will satisfy the equation so our final conclusion is this factorial equation will hold true for x is equal to seven thank you so much for watching do not forget to like share and subscribe as usual bye bye